In the previous video, an introduction to the production possibilities curve, we covered the basics of the production possibilities curve. In this short video, we would elaborate on what happens when there is a movement along the production possibilities curve. Let's recap on the definition of the production possibilities curve. The production possibilities curve PPC, shows all the possible combinations of two goods that can be produced in the economy when resources are fully and efficiently employed, given the state of technology, assuming the economy can only produce the two goods. From this definition, we can see that the production possibilities curve can be used to examine choices in the production of two goods. Choice is shown by the points on the curve. The economy can choose to produce any combination to the curve depending on its objectives. A movement along the production possibilities curve means that the economy has chosen a different set of output. To make things clearer, we will illustrate this with the example we used previously. Tom is a hard-working farmer who owns a small plot of land which can be used to plant oranges and apples. We went ahead to create some choices Tom could have made on the number of oranges and apples to plant. This is the production possibilities curve for oranges and apples Tom can plant in a year. The points along the curve reflect the choices Tom can make in planting the oranges and apples if he utilizes all his resources efficiently. Let's look at the points A and C. At point A, Tom focuses all his resources and is able to plant 200 oranges. So what happens when Tom chooses C to plant 120 oranges and 75 apples instead? Firstly, there is a shift of factors of production from planting the oranges, such as manpower and land, to plant apples instead. This increase in resources dedicated to planting apples results in Tom incurring an opportunity cost. An opportunity cost is the next best alternative foregone. Tom gives up planting 80 oranges and instead he gets to plant 75 apples. From this example, we learn that when there is a movement along the production possibilities curve, the economy has made a choice to produce different combinations of the two goods. The choice to produce different set of output results in a shift of factors of production and the economy incurs an opportunity cost. In the previous example, Tom used some of his resources for planting oranges to plant apples instead. As a result, he incurs an opportunity cost and gives up planting 80 oranges so that he could plant 75 apples. We hope you learned more about the movement along the production possibilities curve. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe for more educational videos.